We are talking now to Eugene McMenamin, class of 1975, from the School of Tourism and Hospitality Management. Thanks so much for being here. You're very welcome. All right, let's, I want to give a little background about what you've been doing uh, since you've graduated from here. And uh, Eugene McMenamin has worked his way up within the hotel and hospitality field. Uh, he began his career in Hyatt Hotels and is now the general manager for the Omni Austin Hotel downtown. Uh, I guess, first of all, what's something about your job that people would be surprised to learn? Oh my lord, that as a general manager, I'm responsible to uh, open trunks of cars, take luggage out, room people, bus tables when needed. I think everybody in the hotel industry is used to that. Everybody does everyone's job when needed based on the demand of the customers. You just pitch in wherever. Absolutely. And you know how to do everybody's job in your hotel. Not as well as they do, but uh, certainly <laughs> I try. That's good. That's good. Um, what would you say for you has been the most rewarding part of your career? Uh, I, I, I believe working with people um, from all different backgrounds. Um, hotels obviously house a very diverse population, everything from leisure, transient travelers, to groups, to very high level VIPs, often have the governor at our hotel, okay. had the president at our hotel, and uh, it gives you an opportunity really to meet and greet mm -hmm. people from all walks of life. On the flip side of that, Eugene, what would you say is the most challenging part of what you do? Keeping customers happy and <laughs> keeping regular customers coming back is a challenge for that industry. Uh, how do you feel about living in Austin now compared to your years here in Philadelphia? Has your industry sort of taken you all over the country? It has. I've worked in many different areas, many different cities. Uh, Philadelphia is my hometown. My heart's here. Go Phillies, go Eagles. <laughs> They're my two favorites, although I like the rest as well, but uh, uh, we don't often get to see teams like that down there. Um, but Austin is a very dynamic city. It's, a, it's grown dramatically over the last 20 years. It's a beautiful town. It's a river city, uh, and there are a lot of activities year-round. It does not have an off-season. Great. Um, how would you say uh, that Temple University prepared you for your career. Obviously, you majored in what you wanted to do for a living, mm -hmm. and you've made that happen. How would you say the Temple experience prepared you? Um, it, was, it was very much out of my comfort zone to come to a large university. Um, I was in a high school in Jersey and spent a couple of years at Rutgers University okay. and transferred here into a completely new uh, realm. New school uh, was in the, uh, at the time it was the HPERD, department and I studied recreation management and met a very diverse group of people here and it was a very challenging time uh, getting to know those people, befriend those people and make my way through the, uh, the three years I spent. What, um, I, I guess what tools do you feel that you left here with? What was in your personal toolkit that's helped you mm -hmm. uh, reach such a high level in your industry? I think your college education builds a quality foundation for you to build from from there. Um, the classes I had here, the practicums that I did while a student here, mm -hmm. uh, pushed me out into the real world, uh, maybe more quickly than just going through a liberal arts type of a program. I worked at Carousel House, which is the first recreation center for physically handicapped people. Did some work at Inglis House, Temple University Psychiatric Hospital, and numerous park systems. So it really got me out into the community to learn what the business was really all about. And then of course the classes here were excellent. I did everything from dance classes to recreation management, leadership. Uh, it was a very, very thorough program. That's terrific. What would your advice be for the class of 2013? They're, they came in in a rough economy. They're leaving in a rough economy. Mm -hmm. What do you advise students who are going to be starting their job hunt in the next couple of months? Wow, that's a, a big question, but I would say work for a quality organization. Um, they tend to do better in off times. Uh, work hard, don't take your eye off your objective, and be relentless in your pursuit of achieving your objectives. Terrific. Our new campaign is Temple Made. Yeah, I like that. How do you feel that you were Temple Made? Well, <laughs> that's an interesting question. I think, you know, reflecting back uh, on my time here, um, again, the experiences with the professors, 
um, the experience at a large university, of course it's much larger these days, uh, really set a quality base for me. And uh, I felt very confident when I left here that I would be able to face new challenges in the business world. And you have met them and succeeded very well. Uh, Eugene McMenamin, class of 1975, School of Tourism and Hospitality Management, currently the general manager for the Omni Austin Hotel downtown. It's a pleasure to meet you. My pleasure. Thanks so much. Thank you and congratulations.